Today, we're going to talk about not just the power of videos, but the power of videos on LinkedIn. Going to share some tips and tricks, so stay tuned. Hello, this is Michael Loftus for Loftus Coaching Consulting and Marketing, helping both advisors and wholesalers stand out from the masses. First up, don't forget you can click show more for additional information and links for today's video. Also, if you find this video of value, please do consider subscribing. So as I've mentioned in my previous videos, I've had an opportunity to travel and give presentations working with some wholesaling firms, but also my audience is primarily financial advisors. And that's about social media and also video, which I love. I am a big believer in that. Our channel now, we're about two and a half years in, ready to hit 800,000 views, and we can see definitive business coming from our social media efforts. But when I get done this presentation, there's so much enthusiasm, everybody's ready to go, and guess what? Nothing happens. No one really jumps on board. So I'm going to push just a little bit harder here. As we go forward, I strongly believe and this can be backed up by some other influencers, Gary V. if you don't know who he is, our two best opportunities as financial advisors are on Facebook and LinkedIn, okay? Two different platforms, obviously, but two different platforms in how you should market to them. So let's go through, first off, a couple of things. Okay, one, let's look at the fact. 80% of B2B leads come from LinkedIn versus 7% of Twitter. Okay, LinkedIn has a perfect domain rating. What does that mean? I mean, Google loves LinkedIn and posts coming from LinkedIn. Okay, there were over 300 million impressions last year from videos on LinkedIn, videos, are three times more likely to be viewed if it is a native video. We'll talk about that. It is five times more to be liked and shared. So yes, great opportunity for all of us to get on board. So what kind of videos are they? You can embed a video, native video, or video ads. So let me show you the first two which are most important, and how to actually do those on LinkedIn. LinkedIn, when you look at the native videos, they play automatically, including the audio. They are 10 times more to be shared. So this is such a great opportunity. Now let's look at some additional tips, because I've seen a big shift as I have been focusing more on this platform. I would embed my video, not get much from it. Now what I do is snippets. Not much happening here last week. Well, actually, let me take that back. A lot happening last week. So we do a weekly video. We'll do the first and the 16th is going to be a market update. Then we do educational videos. What we're doing is 10 second snippets and those snippets will then drive people to our YouTube channel or our website, it depends. We go back and forth. But what happens is, look, we're all busy, right? We know that, but if somebody could get a quick 10 or 15 seconds of what you're talking about, they'll remember it, they'll bookmark it, they'll go back. The other thing is, since we started using snippets, our views have gone up exponentially, as well as right now, our number two source on our YouTube channel is coming from LinkedIn. So we're definitely seeing a correlation between those two. So let's talk about some additional tips. You wanna make sure you include the word video in your tagline there so LinkedIn can pick it up. You wanna go 720p, to 4K, I don't think you need to do 4K. We have the capability, we're not doing that yet. We generally will post at 1080, 
knowing that most platforms are actually going to compress them. Next one is make sure you include or add the option to have closed captions. So if it plays, people can see what's being said, then they can click on the audio to, to be able to hear that. Make sure you structure your videos. I just did a video on that. We'll have a link up here as well as below, but you know, keep those structured, keep them simple. You don't want to be too long. Again, I've done long videos on the platform and they're not getting watched. Okay, last point is you can do horizontal or vertical, but the reality is every video and TVs like this, I put everything out horizontally. So next thing is, as far as some video ideas, we have done several to help you. You know, we've done good, better, best in equipment. Today, I've got a $50 camera on top of my monitor. I have my audio here. I also have an iPhone going over here. So $50, $99 in my iPhone that I have anyway, just to give me a side view when we're going into production. So you don't have to spend a lot of money. I do show good, better, best if you want to get into some of that. I also did a video on how to structure your videos, marketing, etc. cetera, Ecamm, which is what I'm using today to record this. But ideas, you want to think about, like I said, we do market updates, then we do educational, upcoming events, what do you have coming on, highlights from those events, interview speakers at conferences. I've done that several times with good success. Okay, behind the scenes in your office, there's so many different ideas. If you don't have them, obviously you can call us and talk about our services. We have scripts we send out every week to our subscribers. So they don't even have to come with the ideas. They do have to record it though. Wrapping it up, please look at this. Take it seriously. This is the future. There is no better way to talk, communicate, and educate to your clients than this platform. Do you want them listening to big TV or do you want them listening from you? Because if you're not doing it, the truth is other advisors are. I know in my community, I'm the only one doing it and it's making a difference. Thanks so much for watching. Michael Loftus, Loftus Coaching, Consulting and Marketing.